Her name gets changed to Sarah, which means noble woman. And then the Lord declares, and I believe she went back to that many times when she became the mother of Isaac, ultimately became the, the mother of many nations. She experienced doubt, despair, and disbelief. But during those times, she hold tightly to what God told her in the beginning. Is there anything too hard for the Lord? Some of you need to go from princess, come on, to noble woman. Some of you need to say that princess phase is over. Oh, I had that phase, but now I need to become a noble woman. I've got to remind myself that he said, is there anything too hard for me? Is there anything I can't do? And when you become a prophetess, you begin to open up your mouth and you're standing in your living room, but in the spiritual realm, you're standing in that deep valley and you put your finger out like this prophetess and you begin to say, nothing is too hard for my God. My children will be be saved and my grandchildren will be saved and I will leave an inheritance and I will not die in this poverty. I will not die in this obscurity. And you begin to prophesy. Somebody put their hands together and just praise the Lord. If you're willing to cross over.